hello welcome to Izzy's Tarot thank you for coming to my channel you could have gone anywhere but you came to my channel for that I'm always grateful thank you so much I'm going to do a Capricorn love prediction reading for September 2nd through September 8th please keep in mind this is a general read if it's not your story it's not your story don't try to make it your story just take what you can from it and leave the rest in addition please know the energy can go either way it can be your energy your significant other's energy or someone else that's in your love space please keep that in mind as you watch and as you listen if you enjoy my reading or if my reading resonates with you, please give me a subscription or a like. I'd be most humbled. I'm always honored and very grateful if you decide to give me a subscription or a like. Thank you in advance if you do. Let's see what's going on with my loyal, stubborn, kind, loving fun capricorn show me spirit guys what's going on my cappies show me spirit guys what's going on my stubborn capricorns my fun capricorns let's see my loyal capricorns let's see show me spirit guides four pentacles the high priestess six of pentacles the judgment card and the moon well I'm going to look at this I'm going to tell you what I see here this is first of all leaving your reading of the four of pentacles someone was either getting ready to get married it was proposed to or something Something, some, something to do with marriage. Something here with the Four of Pentacles, stability, marriage. There was someone that was either getting ready to get married or someone has been proposed to. There is something that had happened here. However, the high priestess pops up. Uh huh. This high priestess, this is his secret love affair. Whomever this secret is, it is. Uh, I don't. It, you know, this is a secret. Now I'm going to tell you the reason I say it. It's a secret. It is a secret with another woman. I don't even think this man is still with this woman, and I really don't. However, this secret is beyond. This is a secret that you didn't know about another woman. This other woman could have been your friend, just being honest. Could have been a distant cousin. I just That's just what I the spirit guys are telling me. But this other woman could have been, you know, could have happened a long time ago. I don't think it's now. I really don't. I don't think it's now, but it's a secret. That you didn't know about that has just been exposed. Six of Pentacles is in the middle of the reading. That Six of Pentacles lets me know. You're asking him. This is just what I, I'm saying. Why didn't you tell me about this? We have a kind of given, a give and take relationship. A very um, understanding relationship. We can talk about anything. Why didn't you tell me about this? The real, the reason why he didn't tell you about this. Because like I said, this other woman is either a friend a family member, long distance, I don't know, I'm not saying it's now, I think it happened a long time ago, but it's still a secret that you didn't know about, and here's the thing with a Capricorn, because I'm a Capricorn, I'll tell you that every time, because I know how we are, we don't do secrets, I, <laughs> we don't do secrets, if you can't be up front with me now, you're saying, how, why would I ever think of marrying you, if you cannot be up front with me now, if you're holding secrets out now, I don't care who it was with, who, where, how, I don't care. Even if it's been long ago, you did not tell me and I had to find out. The judgment card is there. That judgment card is like you're trying to give this person a second chance. I, I just say you're trying to get back and, and, and get back on the same track with this person. You're trying to give him a second chance. But lo and behold, like I said with a Capricorn, this is extremely different, difficult because uh, you have to forgive Capricorn. It's not that you're not going to forgive, but the problem is, is how do you forget this and move on? Because here's the moon card here, which can represent a Pisces sun sign. Can't be anyone, but the moon card is about deception, betrayals, lies. Now you don't trust him. You don't see him as, as the person that you knew him for before because he held out with this secret. He held out on a secret and now you don't see him the same way. Whatever this marriage proposal or the stability that you were looking for, it's broken. The bond of trust has been broken. 
and you're trying to figure out what do I do? How do I forgive and move? How do I forget and move on? So give me uh, three to five minutes. I'm going to clarify the reading. I'm going to clarify the reading and see what additional information the spirit guides want us to know about this relationship. Sit back, relax, and just give me three to five minutes. Let's see what additional information the spirit guides want you to know about this relationship. Why is this four of pentacles here for my um, Capricorn? Show me, spirit guides. Why is the four of pentacles here for Capricorn? Show me. Let's see. Huh, eight of wands. Swift conversation. This, to me, when I see this eight of wands over this four of pentacles, you, uh, it's almost like you're giving him the biz over it. You're just telling him. I just see it's rapid communication. Eight of wands is like, to me, it's like disgusting, but it's more like, I see you giving him a whole bunch of uh, talk about this. A whole bunch. I mean, you're going in. You're going at him for this. How could you do this? What did you do? You could have told me. I see all of that. All of that. Let's see why the high priestess is here. Show me spirit, guys. Why is the high priestess is here? I basically see you just basically blessing him out. And for lack of a better term, you know, you're just letting him know. Hey, look. Look, this, this trust, this bond is broken. Let's see. Why is the high priestess here? Show me spirit, guys. Five of Wands, conflict, fights. Yeah, y'all going at it. You're going at it because of the secret. I don't do secrets. That's what you told me. I don't do secrets, and you know this. Capricorn, you got to be a little flexible, though. I'm just going to be honest. This is not going on now. It happened a long time ago, but I know how you feel. But you said I do not do secrets. You know I don't. There's conflict. There's fighting going on here. I mean, right now, it's just a, it's just a mess. It's just mess. So let's see why the Six of Pentacles is here. Show me spirit, guys. I think it's also messed because of the way with this Eight of Wands here also. The way that you found out about it. Yeah, I, either somebody told you and you don't like secrets. You don't like secrets. You don't like to be surprised. You don't. So let's see why the Six of Pentacles is here. Show me spirit, guys. Why is the Six of Pentacles here for my Capricorns? Show me why the Six of Pentacles is here for Capricorns. Show me spirit, guys. Oh, the hanged man. The hanged man. Huh. The hanged man is because you still love this man. The hanged man is like just sitting here, just pausing, trying to figure this out. What the heck? What the heck? Why didn't you come to me? Just trying to just figure this out. The hanged man is very well aware of what you need to do. There has to be something. You've got to either move or to come back or, or get it together again. But it's over the six of pentacles because what you what, what's happening here is that we could talk about anything. Why now? Why did I have to find this out? Why is this secret just coming up? You know, that's what's going on here. We, we've had an open relationship. We were able to talk about anything. Well, why this came up is because he knew this was going to be a special, a different kind of hurt for you. That's why he didn't tell you. So let's see why the judgment card is here. Show me spirit, guys. Why is the judgment card here? Show me spirit, guys. Queen of Pentacles, this is you, Capricorn. You've got a bag. You are you know, everything is coming to the forefront now. You're afraid of losing money with him. You're afraid you can't trust him with anything. Queen of Pentacles, she's that girl. She's got a bag. She's very well respected in the community. Hear what I'm saying. She's respected in the community now. Everyone knows the secret but her. Everyone knew the secret but her. Everyone was kind of laughing behind her back but her. She's a Queen of Pentacles woman. She runs things. She's a good woman. She um, People respect her. She could run a business. She could be a CEO. I mean, she is just that girl, but she knows how to take care of home, too. She knows how to take care of home, too. So let's see why this moon card is here. Show me spirit, guys. Why is the moon card here for my Capricorns? Show me. Well, there's that Six of Pentacles again. That Six of Pentacles is about love. It's about a kindness. It's about a give and take. It's about generosity. She's been generous. You've been generous, um, Capricorn, to someone. You've been kind. You know, everything. Everything. And yet they still were deceptive to you because here's this moon card. They still lied. They still didn't tell you this secret. You don't like surprises. That doesn't work in your world. 
You don't like surprises. You don't like lies. I mean, he could have told you. That's how I hear you saying. I don't do surprises. Let's start here at the very beginning of Four of Pentacles. This is something that was supposed to be stable. Possibly even a marriage that was going to happen. But here's the Eight of Wands. Something came through. Some type of information came through. And this information was very, very deep. Okay? It's a secret. Because the High Priestess is here. There's a secret that came to the surface. This is not going on now with your lover. It is not. However, you didn't know about it. He didn't tell you. So now there's conflicts and fights because he didn't tell you. Middle of the reading is the Six of Pentacles. Why? That's what I hear. The Six of Pentacles is we share everything. We're kind to each other. We're loving. We're generous. Have I not been kind? Have I not been generous? Why wouldn't you tell me this? Because it's deep. Either it's an, This is either a family member from a long time ago or it could be a friend um, from a long time ago. It could be anything. But what I'm telling you, this is not just a, this is a secret that you found out about that has blown the lid off of everything. But here's a hangman here. The hangman is having a realization, knowing that you got to do something. I mean, on fire about it, though. Just it's all you're just twirling right now because you still don't understand why he couldn't tell you. But you know that this is this was a secret and you understand you just don't like surprises. Let's just I just don't like surprises. That's all. You don't like surprises. There's a judgment card that's there. And that judgment card to me is like you're trying to get together. The judgment card is about you trying to actually just come together with him again, trying to get it together. Knowing the judgment card is also about realization. You know, you don't like to be made a fool of. You don't like to be for everyone to know but you. And that's how you feel. The trust, the bond has been broken. The Queen of Pentacles, that's who you are. That's you, Capricorn, showing up. Queen of Pentacles is you. That can represent a Capricorn, a Virgo, or a Taurus. But that is you showing up with that Queen of Pentacles. You've got the bag. You could be CEO of a business. You could be all those things. But here's the deal. You're very well respected. You don't like secrets. You don't like people to laugh behind your back. And that's how you feel. You feel broken. The trust bond has been broken. The moon card can represent a Pisces sun sign. The Pisces sun sign, it can, but it's about lies, deception, betrayal. <laughs> and there's that six of pentacles again. My six of pentacles I see with this is my Y card. Why? Why was this necessary for you not to tell me? No matter how much it was going to hurt me, we didn't have secrets and we have secrets now. What else are you hiding from me? That's what I feel. That You know, we've been open with everything else. What else are you hiding? Let's see what my oracles have to say about this. Let's see. What do my oracles... Oh, well, they say Capricorn, that's your card. It's up to you. It's up to you what you're going to do. It's up to you. Um, it says also get more information. I think possibly you should get more information about this. Um, I'm going to, um, I, you know, I, I don't know. I think, I think, because this is what's coming out a year from now. I think that this is going to be just fine. I think the yes, the yes card is coming out, which um, it also says the situation will improve. I just strongly believe, I, I think also, 